And welcome, Wolf of Wolfettes. We are back with the brilliant dreams on the PlayStation 4 Pro. And I think what I'm going to do today is there is a level that I think I mentioned a couple of videos back called Get Home From The Bar. And you play as a random drunk guy that needs to get back to his apartment without falling over too many times whilst drunk. And then there's like cars that can knock you over, pedestrians that can push you over. Pretty funny level. So I might play that today. But one other thing I want to search for, which I think I also might have mentioned in another video, is Kirby. I've never played a Kirby game in my life, I don't think. I tell a lie, I might have played a little bit of one, maybe on the Nintendo 64 yet again. Most of my gaming was done on the Nintendo 64. And then I bought a GameCube and I played only Pokemon games on that. And then I got a Wii and I only played that one Pokemon game that released. Or it might have been the Wii U. It was at Pokemon Battle Revolutions or something. That game where you could plug in your Game Boy Advance and then put all your Pokemon in it and do like 3D battles. It might have been on the Wii, but I got a Wii for that. The Wii U I never played because there was no Pokemon games, even though I do own quite a few games for it, like Pikmin and that. And then I've got uh, a Nintendo Switch because of Pokemon Let's Go Eevee and uh, also because of Pokemon Sword and Shield. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> but um, I played a lot on the Nintendo 64 and I think I might have played a Kirby game on that. But other than that, I've never played one. So we're going to search and see if there's any Kirby type levels. Oh, Sonic is another one we could search for as well. Right, let's have a look then. I didn't think there was going to be that many results. So we've got Kirby in space. That actually looks like a pretty decent level. Kirby wants oatmeal. Alright then. Kirby Dreamland. The Kirby Project. Kirby Lost in Dreamland. That's got quite a lot of likes on it. I'm going to fly for you. Okay. PP Music. Oh no. It's the password guy, isn't it? Memes. So basically... Donkey played my dream. Oh god, video game Donkey is another YouTube channel. You've probably heard of him. <laughs> right, I'm going to start off with that first level, that first Kirby level. We'll play through this one, and then we'll play through the other one that's got a thousand likes on it. And then after that, I'll do that level I mentioned. Kirby in Space, made by Nick and Autumn 420. And let's click on the full credits as usual. Give a quick scroll just to show off some of the other people. Lovely jubbly. There we go. Beautiful. Right, let's give this a play. It doesn't look like it's going to be a very long level, but we'll give it a play and see how good it is. Now, uh, oh my, oh, look at that. That is adorable. They've, they've made Kirby beautiful. This is probably one of the nicest made character models I've seen. And that is beautiful. Look at the colours in this part. I mean, oh my God. Oh my god. What is that? Kirby's got another eye. Why has Kirby got an eye on his shoulder? I thought this was a perfect model until I saw that. That is terrifying. <laughs> Why you got an eyeball on your shoulder, Kirby? What are you doing? And how comes that's the only one that blinks? It's like that eye blinks, but your actual eyes don't. Can, you, can Kirby fly, can't he? Oh my god. That is a... Um, oh, shit. Oh, no. I just killed little Kirby. Okay. So, it's definitely like Kirby. Kirby's very floaty and very bouncy. That's one thing I do know, even though I haven't played any of the Kirby games. Except one on the Nintendo 64. This is going to be very difficult. I wish you wouldn't bounce when you landed, Kirby. Now, this is beautiful, ain't it? Like, Dreams just seems to be the perfect game for somebody like Kirby. Because you could imagine, like, Kirby jumping around in all this weird, dreamy sort of land and all that. You, know, you could imagine Kirby being somewhere like this. I was playing as Kirby a lot in Smash Bros. Because I got Smash Bros in, uh, I think it was December I got it. And uh, I played it a little bit against Tom Wolf. He, he absolutely kicked my ass. I'm not going to lie. But uh, I was playing through the story mode and I was playing as Kirby. Because Kirby is who you start playing as. And then as you go through it, you unlock other characters you can play as, I think. But uh, yeah, I played quite a bit as Kirby. And uh, yeah, I don't like Kirby in Smash Bros. <laughs> he's, just, he's just so teeny. And his, his punches just don't feel like they do any damage because he's so little. They obviously do, but yeah. <laughs> Is this the end of the level? Oh, look at all these coins. Oh man, I'm loaded. Is that it? Can I, can I do anything else? Oh, 
man, that is a nice, that'd be a nice thumbnail. Man, this is beautiful, ain't it? Too bad it's so short. Right, well, I guess that's the end of the level then. Right, let's, uh, let's give that a thumb up. That is utterly beautiful. Well done, Nick and Autumn 420. That is beautiful, very beautiful. Right, let's uh, exit the creation and let's try the other one. Hopefully there's one with like actual combat. I'm just trying to find random levels at the moment. I am going to start playing this a lot more on my own and actually showing off some of the levels with like full-on games and enemies and all that kind of stuff. Like the uh, Crash Trip Sanity level and the uh, Donkey Kong Odyssey level, stuff like that, you know. Right, Kirby Lost in Dreamland. This looks like it might be a bit more of a game. 3D platformer, Kirby game. Hopping from, hoping for some Kirby music and sound effects someday. Made by Trum Trum 63. And as always, let's click on the full credits. Show off. Oh, not too many people this time. Lovely. Right, hopefully this is a full kind of game. Oh, it's a 2D one, okay. Let's just, uh... Oh, is this an animation or something? Oh no, okay. I was gonna say, is this some sort of animation? Because it said it was a game. Press cross to jump. Press X to jump, I should say. Oh, once again, this Kirby is very floaty. This Kirby doesn't have a random eyeball sticking out of his shoulder, which is very nice. Press cross while in the air. Press X while in the air to air hop. Kirby can air hop multiple times. You mean just flap his wings? Yeah, it's just, it's just flapping his wings, to be honest, ain't it? Looks like we've got some sort of enemy over there. I'm not actually sure if Kirby can attack. What does Kirby do? Kirby, like... Sucks people into his mouth, doesn't he? Or she? Kirby can inhale by pressing R2. Oh, nice! <laughs> Damn it. Kirby's spit attack can break star blocks and explode bomb blocks. P.S. Enter a checkpoint to respawn all enemies. Okay. Probably in case you miss. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god! Does that give me like some sort of power up? Yes, it does. Oh, that is amazing. I forgot that Kirby could do this kind of stuff. Oh, is that it? Damn it. That was very good, that was. They had all of the mechanics down to a T, didn't they? They had a flying Kirby. They had him absorbing enemies and eating them. Not sure how he does it, considering he's so tiny. Is Kirby a boy or a girl? I always thought Kirby was a girl. But when I heard the voice of uh, it, it sounds a bit boyish, I don't know. Is Kirby a boy or a girl? Or is that like a question that people have been trying to find out for years and Nintendo just don't tell you? I'm not actually sure, to be honest. Right, um... Well, I guess we can have a look at what this is. Made by a Mr. Curlium. Mr. Curlium. Mr. Callium. Mr. Callium. I suppose we can have a look at what this is. I don't think this is going to be a proper level. I feel like this is just going to be like a, you know, like a showcase of what, what you can do with the game and Kirby and all that kind of stuff, I'm assuming. Oh my god! A oh, Dual Shock 4 is making a bit of noise. Oh, now that is not remotely annoying at all, is it? <laughs> Alright, that's gonna bother the hell out of me, that is. Oh, 
Man, the vibration, this is going to make my DualShock 4 batteries run out. The amount of vibrating it's doing. This is the first person, the first creation that I've seen that's even made use of the DualShock 4 speaker. I didn't even know you could do stuff like that. I've not even tried making a level yet, so I've got no idea of the possibilities. I just know you can make something ridiculous if you want to take the time to do it. This is very relaxing, this is. One thing I will say though, is a lot of the creations in this game have got very loud music. Like the, the amount of lowering I have to do when I edit these videos is insane, because the music is so loud. I don't know if this is annoying you guys and girls, I don't even know if you can really hear it, but my DualShock 4 keeps making this random drum beat. It's a nice beat, but yeah. <laughs> Should we see if we can get to the top of this like man? Oh, if you just hold cross, you just sort of flow. Should we come up here? This is like a good kind of place you want to go fishing, doesn't it? Actually, nah, nah. There won't be many fish up here. Because if any fish are in here, they're just going to end up falling down. It'd probably be better to do the fishing down there. Have you seen it when uh, the salmon are doing that migrating thing that they do, or when they're breeding, or whatever that thing is that they do, and then they swim up like waterfalls and stuff like that? They, salmon are amazing. They do some amazing things, they do. It's very fun to fly around, I just wish I could actually do something. Right, so I'm going to leave this level just because of the beat. Oh no, this Kirby's got a third eye as well. Oh god damn it. <laughs> right, I'll give it a fall up anyway. Right, let's leave. Right, let's have a look. I don't think there's any other Kirby levels that we can try. I mean, that, that Kirby right there looks absolutely terrifying. Let's have a look at this. Made by A-Link123. It's a black and white Kirby with the same mutated eye on its shoulder. And for some reason, the eye is red. So this is definitely an evil kind of Kirby. I feel like this is going to end up having some jump scares. Why is it black and white? And if this ends up jump scaring me, I'm going to be fuming. Oh, what the hell? My eyes just sort of appeared on the rock. What is that? I can't attack it, whatever it is. This is some horror kind of stuff, isn't it? <laughs> Why is it black and white? You ain't gotta worry, mate, I can't actually attack. Or can I? Oh, I could do a little dance by the looks of it. <laughs> Can't actually uh, do anything else though. I thought that was just some scenery. I didn't think that was actually going to teleport me anywhere. It's like this is actually the only, like an actual proper level, but I can't actually fight anyone. Now what a tune! Let's say copyright. Let's, uh, let's get up on here and do a little dance. You ready? <laughs> there we go. Beautiful. Now look how happy Kirby is. He's stuck in some weird black and white world with a bunch of evil guys that he's not even able to inhale. But he seems to be having a fantastic time, doesn't he? Doing a little jig. Speed it up a little bit. Oh, lovely. Beautiful. Beautiful. I always like making these dream videos just because of the random things that you find. <laughs> it's, what, it's sort of similar to the Pac-Man uh, World Remake levels. Like, if all of the, all of the different uh, Kirby levels were combined, you'd have the perfect Kirby game inside of dreams. <laughs> like, if you imagine this kind of stuff combined with that space one we just did, that would be like the perfect kind of game. And then have the uh, mechanics of the other one we just did, you'd have the perfect Kirby game. 
So if all these creators work together, took an hour of their day or whatever, I don't know, I don't know how busy they are, I don't know if they're kids or adults, but you know, when they get home from school, when they get home from work, they spent an hour all working together, got together in PlayStation party chat or, I don't know, Discord or something, they could, uh, they could make a really good Kirby game. But that'd be pretty damn good actually. They could set up Patreon and get people to donate to them if they want them to make certain levels. I think some people are doing that in dreams, setting up Patreons and then you can like donate to them. I've got a Patreon too, wink wink. <laughs> oh, I'm a scumbag, I do apologise. Is this the end? There we go, beautiful. I mean, it was terrifying, I thought I was going to get jump scared. I don't trust anything in black and white. Especially after playing that game Limbo, that was, that was weirdly creepy. I don't think it had jump scares, but it's just really creepy. Right. I don't think there's any other Kirby levels for me to really try out, to be honest. I think that might be it. Have we tried this one? Yeah, we did. We tried the Kirby Project. We tried Kirby Dream Land. This one was the most beautiful one by far. This one's very nice. If they combine this one right here with this one, and this one, you'd have the perfect Kirby, even that one in some ways as well, you'd have the perfect uh, Kirby game. Why is there a Minecraft wolf? Do not disturb Sven's alone time. That's what uh, PewDiePie named his dog in um, his Minecraft playthrough, didn't it? I saw a music video of that. These are definitely not Kirby levels. Right, I think I'm just going to have to end it for now, Wolf and Wolf X. Uh, I don't think I'm going to have enough time to do that get home from the uh, bar level because that one does take a bit of time. And if I keep falling over too much, then it can take even longer. So I think we'll do that next time. But yeah, um, thanks for watching, Wolf and Wolf X. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and the last video. Sorry that they were a little bit like lacklustre. Like, the levels were great, but they're not actual full-on levels where you're doing stuff. So it ends up just being, like, random showcases with me talking a load of rubbish for 20 minutes. <laughs> but, you know, the people will work on the levels. They'll add to it. Some people haven't got much free time, you know, so it's obviously, it's hard for them. But I'm sure in time, all of these will end up being very good levels. They're already very good, but I mean, like, actually proper levels with enemies and boss battles and all that good shit. But, yeah. Thanks for watching Wolf of Wets. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Sorry it's a bit shorter today. I'll uh, make the next one a bit longer, hopefully. But yeah, I think next time I've got a good idea of the kinds of levels we're going to play. And they're going to be very random. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Like, share, join the pack today.